What's good YouTube fam? Welcome back to another video guys. Today we're going to be installing an exhaust on the Honda Rebel 500. Whoa. And that's going to be, what the hell is this called? The Shorty GP exhaust by Lost Star. Never heard of them. Uh, but anyways, here it is guys. Pretty much uh, what it is, is pretty much just a glorified muffler delete. The other day I had to take the muffler off of this bike. Uh, and I just turned it on to hear what it would sound like and it sounded really mean. So I just went ahead and purchased it on Amazon. I'm gonna leave a link down in the description if you do want to get this exhaust. Honestly, it's a very simple, very easy install. It's literally just uh, two bolts holding the exhaust in place. Uh, and then this just kind of slips on in there. It gets held on by a flange, which is also included in the box. So we're gonna go ahead and take off the OEM exhaust and we're gonna throw this GP on and let's see what it sounds like. Okay guys, so for this job, you're going to need a 12 mil and you're also going to need a 10 mil. I recommend that you get an open wrench like this with a, a socket and a ratchet. So first we're going to be removing the exhaust off of this bracket right here that comes off of the bike. You put your 12 there and I feel like it's easier if you just first break this bolt right here. It should be pretty loose. And then you can just hold the back with a wrench and you should be able to take it off pretty easily like this. And then you, you want to save this just in case in the future you need to revert back to the stock for whatever reason. Then you want to come here and you want to just remove this 12 that's underneath the exhaust. This one should be pretty loose as well. And obviously you want to do this while the bike is cold so you're not burning your fingers on your exhaust. And this should be able to just slide out with a good wiggle. And there you have your stock exhaust. This thing weighs a ton. Put that to the side. And we're going to grab our shorty. Make sure you have the flange on there. That just slides right over like such. I'm not really sure how this is supposed to be angled. I think we'll do it like this. Does that look cool? Well, that looks whack. I'm not sure, is it supposed to be like this? I'm gonna go with this angle. Once I'm pleased with the angle, I think we'll go like that. Grab the 10 and just tighten it. And there you have it guys. That's pretty much it for the Shorty GP. I forgot to mention, if you do decide to take this bracket off, it's simply held by two hex keys right here. Uh, I use a T40 to take it off. You can pretty much use any hex that fits into this right here and just remove those two bolts, take the bracket off and put the bolts back in place. I decided to take it off because it looks kind of funny. You know the bracket just sitting there so i decided to take it off clean it up a little bit now that the uh, exhaust is no longer being used by this um there was no purpose for me to keep it on so i decided to take it off i saved the two bolts i'm gonna save all this hardware for the future just in case i want to put a, a second seat on here i know this is where the pecs go so you also want to take that into consideration make sure that you keep this hardware and you keep this uh, oem stuff just in case you decide to revert back to it for whatever reason
All right, guys, I'm gonna close the video out here. Unfortunately, I was so excited on that day that I forgot to film an outro. So it's already been like two or three weeks that I've had the exhaust on the bike. I will say though that uh, I'm gonna give you my honest opinion and that is that I like it. I don't personally love it, but I do like it. There are some complaints that I have with it uh, and I'm gonna make a separate video uh, where we go in depth and we talk about the exhaust in a separate video. Oh my God, this camera is so heavy. Um, but like I was saying, I like it. it. It's it's really good if you're looking for something cheap, something quick, something that is very simple to install. If you're looking for like an easy mod that you want to do to your bike, that's gonna bring it to life. Uh, this will definitely do that for you. Uh, but like I said, it's not perfect, but it is a fun little mod that you can do for very cheap uh, and very quick. And if that is what you're looking for, then that is what this exhaust is. I'm going to leave a link in the description. Uh, if you guys did enjoy the video, please remember to hit the like button. Also subscribe for more uh, Rebel content and uh, some more BRZ content and some other stuff we got planned on the channel. I hope to see you guys in the future videos. Uh, thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out. So. We're gonna go ahead, take off the exhaust. The uh, and that is it. And that you um. Today, we're gonna be installing a Honda. Honda, yeah. And I'm really hoping that this does change the car. The car. Four in the morning. Roll up the potent, smoking the propane, mixing the potion, mixing the 20 with Henny and Remy. Falling out finger roll, yeah, with the jelly. Vibing out, you can find me at the telly. The drugs kicking in, damn, my palms getting sweaty. Know that I'm peaking, yeah, I be speeding.